Hey guys, my name is Leslie and this is Texan TV. Faculty and staff, every year during homecoming week, we select the staff member as the faculty night and dame. Please use the link below to nominate the night and dame for homecoming 2016. Miss Nusa, yeah, quit texting me. But, but I was telling you there's a blue out tomorrow. Uh, you just told me there's a blue out tomorrow. Hey, what are we gonna wear? Well, duh, we're gonna wear our blue out shirts, the Sam side Sam Pride shirts, the one that oh, everybody got. Oh, the ones with the big Texan on the back? Uh-huh, uh -huh. The one that she's wearing right there? Yeah, that one right there. Hey, yeah. hey, Texan girl, come here real quick. Hurry, these hurry, shirts. hurry. These shirts. shirts, look. These everybody shirts. wear these shirts tomorrow. Turn around, show us your Texan. Show us your Texan, there you go. Let's all be Texans and blew out buoy. Blew out. Woo! What's up, Texans? My name is Drew, and I'm the Texans Talk newspaper ad editor this year. I've got some news to share with you about both publications. Let's talk about newspaper first. Yes, we have a school newspaper. Visit us at texanstalk.org to keep up with all your SHHS news. As a matter of fact, when you visit our website, scroll down to the bottom and subscribe. That way, our latest stories will go straight to your email. Yes, guys, we still publish a print newspaper, but only twice a school year, and that's December and May. Now, let's talk about yearbook. This year's yearbook theme is This Is Us. The book will feature stories and comments from you guys about how we won't let anyone define us. Look out for more announcements about how you can share your story. Your books are $35 until Friday. We sold out last year, so stop by room 1221 to put $5 down on your book or visit texanstalk.org and click on the yearbook banner to order online. Don't forget to trick out your yearbook by printing your name on the cover. Buying an autograph book or a world yearbook for only $5 extra per item. Lastly, don't forget to follow us on Twitter at Texans, talk, un, Texans underscore talk. We post photos, stories, and links to submit your senior quotes or your photos for the yearbook. This is Drew, and I'm out. Teachers, our faculty parking stickers are finally in. Please see Mr. Cabrera to get more information. French Club t-shirts are on sale for $15. Cash or checks made out to SHHS French Club will be accepted. Put your cash or check in an envelope with your name and t-shirt size and bring money to Ms. Harms in room 230 or room 408 for Ms. Isaacs by October 7th. If you have any questions, please call extension 76233 or 76243. The Never Alone Project is an initiative aimed at finding walking partners and groups for those students who walk to and from school alone. The purpose of the Never Alone Project is to ensure that no Sam Houston Texan is ever left feeling alone and vulnerable. If you would like to find someone who lives near you to walk with, come see Ms. Gallegos in room 629 for more information. Junior class t-shirts are now on sale. Class of 2018, please purchase your t-shirt this week from a junior class officer or from Dr. Edwards in room 208 after school. The t-shirt prices are $15 for the short sleeve, $20 for the long sleeve shirt, and $25 for the hoodie. Or if you can, purchase all three for $50. Acapella Club meets every Tuesday and Thursday from 3 to 4.30 in the choir room, number 704. Hey guys, my name is Abby. And this is Victor, and we're from Texan TV. And today we're going to be asking you guys. Who do you think won the presidential debate? I didn't watch the debate last night as much as I wanted to. Mm -hmm. um, but the, some of the comments that I heard this morning said that uh, Ms. Clinton uh, actually was stayed to policy, was very specific, and uh, I think uh, probably had an edge last night. That's basically what I heard this morning. I think Hillary won the debate last night because Trump was just uh, talking mess about Hillary, and he wasn't really speaking up speaking out about issues yeah I think the same thing he talked more about like Obama and stuff like that instead of actually putting action for like what we need as a president I think Hillary won the debate because she made a really lot of good points and she really emphasized most of the important things okay so who do you think won the presidential debate last night Donald Trump because he had good eye contact and good body language and I also believe he could be a good president because Hillary, she all she did is just looked at her paper and then look out to the audience. She was basically lying all the time. So I believe Donald Trump could be a good president. 
and a good leader? Um, I think Hillary won because she actually had solutions to uh, the questions that um, the guy was asking while Trump was just repeating himself and wasn't giving uh, clear answers and was just bashing Hillary for um, previous uh, problems that she had, like the emails and stuff like that. Students, this is a reminder that this is the last week left in our first six weeks grading period. This Friday, September 30th, is the last day for teachers to collect grades. Students, if you have received free or reduced lunch in the past, you must ensure we have an updated application on file this year. All students must reapply every year in order to receive this benefit. Last year, we had many students that did not turn in their forms on time and they were charged full price for their lunch. October 3rd is the deadline to turn in your form. Please have your parents fill out the form and return to the cafeteria as soon as possible. Congratulations to our September Teacher of the Month, Ms. Grogan, and this month's Paraprofessional of the Month, Jennifer Bernal. Students and staff, be sure to congratulate those staff members when you see them. athletes will begin meeting on Wednesday mornings at 7 a.m. You do not have to be an athlete to join. If you're interested or have any questions, see Coach Barlow, Coach Rodriguez, Coach Vasquez, or Coach Jacob. Remember, Destination Success will take place on November 5th, 2016. Get ready and prepare to attend. Superintendent Dr. Cavazos was named 2016 Superintendent of the Year for Texas by the Texas Association of School Boards. The SOTY program has recognized exemplary superintendent for excellence and achievement in education leadership since 1984. Every month a student is given the Derek Kenny Body Texan Award. It's for a leader on campus who's always doing the right thing and just again and so uh, but anyway I'll tell you more for that you can tell her more about uh, Derek Kenny. Right? Oh, great. Yes. Derek is a local businessman and mm -hmm. he graduated from Sam Houston and so he just really appreciates giving back to leaders at the school. So we got an award for you and look at what's on top of that. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, so congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. Those are all the announcements I have for you today. My name is Leslie and this is Texan TV.